So guys, this guy disrespected the shit out of me. So uh, I'm going and meeting up with him. So I'll not. I probably won't be able to record this, but I'll tune back in with you guys after this is over. Uh, I'll have to record my intro later because I'm too hype. Here we go. Keep it right there, keep it right there. <gasps> Should I try to get it off? What is up, my riders? This is the happiest you guys will ever see me because I know you guys don't like when I do this, but look at this. Oh my gosh. And cinnamon sticks. Whew. So guys, I'm starting this video out the day that you're seeing the poppy, like, video that I kind of like, not made fun of her, I just wanted to um, do like kind of like a parody. Didn't record anything else other than that. Went to my cousin's house and as you saw, she did like my makeup to make me look like I was beat up. I always wanted to see what it would look like. I hope you guys enjoyed that little bit. I'm eating for the first time today, as you can tell. It's a cheat day, even though it's not a cheat day. Like, there's no way I'm getting all my calories in today. But what I want to do after I finish this food, I want to see what happens when you melt a penny. And pennies aren't copper anymore. I'm sure everyone knows that. But I've always wondered what happens. I hope it's not illegal to do. Because it is legal tender, but we'll find out just for the record it's not real money now guys tell me how good this looks cinnamon sticks Casey knock it off my dog thinks she can just eat everything and it comes with cinnamon cinnamon it comes with cinnamon obviously it comes with icing This is how you do it big on your cheat days. New day, new video. We found this outside a while ago. I don't know why we still have it, but. It's gone. 
Okay guys, now I want to talk to you guys about um, something just because that's what this uh, little bit in the uh, video needs to be. People I guess are getting confused with the giveaways and stuff and I'm just going to set this straight. Um, I don't know how else to say it. I say it on Twitter all the time. I don't know how else for everyone to hear it without like titling a video just making it specifically about this alone. But I mean some of you guys only watch some of the videos like some of you only watch some of the contest videos and you're not even watching them so you don't know so let me just clarify for everyone that has no idea so if my contest video you can look in the description of all my contest videos it'll tell you when it ends and what you need to do to be entered in the video I'll tell you what the goal I have set for us to meet. If we don't meet that criteria or that objective or the goal, then it's not going to be a giveaway. We did not meet any of the giveaways in the past. The, the ones that you guys see now, you guys can comment on it all you want, it's done. If you guys want me to put done in the title, I'll put done in the title, but usually I put done in the title and people still comment on it, so I don't. The contest video that is up now the most recent one that I posted like two days ago, three days ago, is the most recent one. The one that is posted recently is going to be the most recent giveaway. If I post a recent giveaway video, all the other giveaway videos are no longer active because we didn't meet criteria, so I'm trying to help you guys out by giving you guys another shot. And there's always different criteria to the different ones. People are getting mad because they're saying, oh, he's doing these giveaway videos and he's never given away the ones for this video. Well, you guys didn't meet the criteria, so don't get mad when you know like the video, what the video is about. You have to watch the giveaway video. And this isn't, I'm not talking directly to every single one of you guys. I'm only talking to a very tiny, tiny bit. But don't get mad if I didn't give it away. If you look back, I gave away a PS4, and I gave away an iPhone, and then I gave away another iPhone in one of my videos that I didn't even make a public announcement because I don't like making my, my giveaway announcements public because then people harass the winner and they also harass me for saying that I didn't give them a fair shot. So it's easier to just contact the winner and not tell anyone and just say, okay, the winner was announced so that that winner only knows and he, can, he or she can keep himself private. That's like the best way and the best option. Now, the most recent giveaway video, I didn't say this in it and I didn't state this in this. The most recent contest video is going to be given away to the most active subscriber. That means you have to be active. That means you have to comment, you have to like, you have to uh, stray off from the normal. You have to actually watch my other videos. And it's going to be active people only. If you only comment on the contest video, I'm not even going to put you in the contest and that's like an idea that a lot of my fans gave me um, it basically cuts out the middle the the small percentage of the people that don't actually care they just enter for the contest they literally like if you go down through their um, timeline or their um, history all they do is go and spam all the contest videos that they can find I wanted to touch upon something else so this will be going to the only active subscribers, but there's going to be a catch now. If you donate to me, it's not going to be a donations giveaway because that's technically like illegal to do because I'm not going to take donations for you to be entered into contest. That's not what I'm saying. If you donate to me, there's going to be separate contests with different prizes. The majority of the time better than what my contests are going to be going um, from. This is going to be the last iPhone giveaway that I'm posting most recently and then it's going to go to like Amazon gift cards and, and stuff of that nature whereas my donations for people that donate to me out of the kindness of their heart they get a chance at getting something back because they're spending money on me and I'm getting a lot of donations and I feel bad for taking that money because it's like I know it's a donation that is their kindness of their out of their kindness of their heart they're trying to help me as a channel but I want to give back so since a lot of people aren't even stating who they are when they when they donate to me what I'm gonna do is have a donation giveaway so 
you want to put your name in the donations when you put them in now because there is going to be better giveaway options for you guys that donate just because solely if you're going to donate to me i want to give back to you guys so this is not saying donate to me to get into this contest or this giveaway this is if you normally donate to me or if you're donating to me or if you're thinking about donating to me and you actually have done it or are actually going to do it before seeing this video go ahead and do it because you're going to be entered in a giveaway that's going to be higher up like better better uh giveaways like macbooks uh, iphone 7s like stuff like that nature because i want to get back to the people that actually care a lot and that are giving me this this giving me this like opportunity they're they're literally i don't even care for the dollar they're saying here i believe in you so that to me means a lot and i don't want them to only have the same opportunity as everyone else if that makes sense because a small percentage of you just watch my videos for my contest i'm not saying i know a lot of uh, a lot of my uh, viewers actually support me full-heartedly and i love you guys i i you guys that actually do that, words cannot describe how much how how much of a blessing you guys are to my life. But um, I think that this is only fair. And don't worry, the guys that are still can't afford to donate or are too young to donate, you still get opportunities to win Amazon gift cards. I mean, $100 for an Amazon gift card, that's a lot of money, especially for a kid or something that's um, younger. And um, you guys get to buy whatever you want. So, um, yeah, I just had to do this little rant. I hope this makes sense. If you have any questions, make sure to comment or contact me on Twitter. And, yeah, Casey. Casey, hey, are you getting bigger? Are you getting bigger? Casey, are you getting bigger? All right, guys, I'm going to finish out the day or night with watching uh, Shane. Not really an exciting day. Tomorrow, getting my car inspected and the downpipe, I think is gonna be installed tomorrow, so get hyped for that. I love you guys. Um, can't wait to bring that video to you. Sorry for the lack of content today, but I'll see you in tomorrow's video, and I love you guys.